welcome to the cradle and welcome to this sweet little baby boy who was just born in the nursery today. So this is the Twin Bee Sculpt by Bonnie Brown. I'm not sure how familiar you are with Reborns, but he took over 50 hours to paint all of his little details. I think you can see like his little nails and little nail beds. Um, he does have a magnet in him, so he takes a magnetic pacifier, which he will come with, and you just place it like that. So he has that. He will come with all kinds of goodies, a bottle, blanket, that sort of stuff, outfits. I haven't dressed him in anything yet, but these are all his details. He has mottling. You can see all the little veins on him. Um, a lot more details in person, but uh, a lot is showing up on the camera, which is nice. He has a beautiful head of painted hair with a little swirl in the back. Um, I am going to do a little photo session with him, so um, you can see all his details, like those long little lashes. I love his little lips, partially open mouth could probably, I've never tried to make him like suck a little, a thumb or a finger. <laughs> I don't know if he can or not, but super cute. I'm getting ready to dress him into a cute little outfit if you want to um, watch his video. I should have a video with him and Twin A, who is the little girl, um, up on my YouTube channel as well. But these are all his little creases and his toes. So his legs are what we call full legs. So there's the little diaper. I'm gonna open this up and show you how the belly plate works because they do both come with little belly plates. But we have what are called three-fourths arms. So this one has like a jointed arm, but the reason why his sculpting artist did this was so that his arms and um, hands are more poseable and flexible. So you want that a little bit more loose, whereas the lower legs just kind of move and turn like so. So let me get his little belly plate so I can show you how that works. So this baby does come with a little belly plate. We mostly use these for photography purposes, but I can show you how to put it on him. And he does come with his certificate of authenticity so that you know it's an authentic reborn kit. And I will put my card in with him so you'll always remember who his artist is and you can keep that with him um, in his little box or whatever with all his belongings. So mommy wants to see you. So he is weighted to five pounds. I weight the limbs, all of the limbs are weighted, the head is weighted and the body is weighted as well. So he has this cute little diaper. This is a little honest uh, onesie and it is newborn size and you could probably fit him into some newborn and preemie sizes. I believe the little Carter's outfit that I'm gonna put on him um, will be probably preemie, but I'm kind of strange. I like all my clothes to fit kind of loose on my babies. So I would always put these two probably in uh, newborn size. This is a newborn size diaper. So with the belly plates, so see they have like a little gathered chest with their cloth body. Um, I'm not going to air this on YouTube because YouTube gets weird. They don't realize that these are dolls because they look so realistic. So I don't want to get dinged on YouTube. So I won't show this video on YouTube, but they have like a little, a little booty. Very cute. And what I do with the belly plates is I just open up the diaper, has this sweet little belly button that I love. I love putting these babies in the newborn huggies because they have the umbilical cord cut out so that you can see their little belly button. It's so sweet. So I basically just put this little belly plate on the tummy like so, put it around the baby, super easy should explain what I'm doing. And then you can just fasten the diaper like you normally would. Just like that. And then you can kind of move 
the diaper down and adjust it so that the umbilical cord cutout shows the little belly button. <laughs> Isn't that like the cutest? So if you wanna do pictures and post your baby, if you feel comfortable making like an Instagram account or something, um, or a YouTube account just for like reborn babies, um, you can do like sweet little photos with your baby. So super cute. I will include like other outfits and uh, diapers and a baby bottle and things like that that you can use for him. So I normally don't leave the little belly plates on because it does make them feel uh, a little bit stiffer and not as cuddly. So um, also the diaper just fits a lot better without it. Um, they're mostly just used for photos. I only use them for photography purposes and I will send you a bunch of photos with him to show you kind of like what it looks like. So he is a little bit heavy. So I have this cute little outfit. I will be choosing kind of like what he goes home in and what he goes home with but um, I always put my babies in like cute little clothes. Let's see if this, this is a newborn size um, onesie by Honest. It all depends on the brands and things like that um, and what the material is made of. This is all cotton. It's like a cotton thermal and it looks like it'll fit this baby fine. Uh, outfits do shrink when you wash them, especially if you wash them on hot. So. Sometimes it's just hard to tell after something's been washed and I would always, always wash clothes before you put these on your baby because um, some of the dyes can transfer over onto the baby's skin. I always try to choose light colored outfits. So if you wanna go with like yellows and greens and blues and grays and tans and creams and things like that for him, that would probably be best. So this looks like it fits him just fine. Very cute little outfit for him. So sweet. And I love this baby because you can pose him so sweet. I just love the way that they pose. I love that little arm. And you can put something in here too, like a little lovey for him to hold on to or a little, a little blanket. So sweet. Absolutely love this little guy. Let me try to find a little photo prop teddy bear or something for you so you can kind of get an idea. So I don't send home my photo props, but I do find these really cheap for like $12, $10 on Amazon. You can find some really cute crocheted stuff. I just want to see how he'll look with this like little teddy bear hat. I Like I said, I use these as photo props and it takes me a long time to find what I'm looking for. And um, I collect certain things for my babies for photos. So I don't send them home with these items, but um, I love Amazon. So you can find a lot of really cute stuff on Amazon. I may even just tie it like that. Oh, how cute. I was kind of curious to see what he would look like. <laughs> We're gonna give him a little teddy bear to hold so he can hang on to that. Is that not the cutest? <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this little video of your sweet little baby boy just for you, a little personal video. And I really hope this little one can come home with you soon. Say bye mama. I hope you love him. I hope he's just what you're looking for. Let me know if this is the baby for you. I hope he is. He's totally adorable and made with lots of love just for you. So let me know. I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Mm -hmm.